Group six, business as usual. Design challenge two. We explore the myth that the senior manager needs aggregated information, which a formal management information system best provides. Our CEO has just learned about a new management information system and is excited to implement it in his large international company. Not knowing how to implement the management information system himself, our CEO finds a qualified trainer to teach all of his supervisors and lower level managers so that they can use the system. As the instructor is teaching all of the new information that the supervisors and lower level managers will have to implement, they begin to realize that they will be losing a lot of valuable communication that they once had with their lower employees. As they expected, the supervisors began to see that their numbers began to decrease and the results were lessened by the increased demand of the management information system. Upset by the newfound numbers, the CEO brings the instructor in to identify the real problem. The instructor informs the CEO that even though he taught them well how to use the management information system, the managers were better at communicating through conversation and face-to-face -face interaction than they were through using hard data and the actual information that the management information system provided them. Given the information from the trainer and the supervisor data, the CEO comes to the conclusion that the management information system is not as valid and useful as he once thought it was. He informs the technology director to shut down the servers that the management information systems are on and that they will no longer be needing the system. The information in this PowerPoint was provided by the textbook Management, the third edition, as well as the paper The Manager's Job, Folklore and Facts, The Classical View 